Hi guys, so right now it's 6 17 a.m. I literally got less than two hours of sleep last night But today's finally the day that I'm leaving to Hong Kong, which is just crazy to think about But so many of you guys have been commenting and DMing me that you're so excited for my study abroad vlogs My hair dried weird because I washed it and then just slept right away Now, but I'm just sitting down to catch a breath. I can't believe I'm finally in Hong Kong. Oh my god, this feels unreal. I made my choice, wanna see what's going on. I'll be there at the after party. Show up looking like a zombie. It don't matter, nobody stop me. Okay guys, so I finally made it to my dorm room. Anyways, right now it's 3.21 p.m. Obviously the first thing I have to do is unpack and kind of settle in to my room because right now it's just like completely bare. I'll give you guys a little dorm tour right now. I've seen pictures of this dorm already because last semester my friend was also studying abroad here and he sent me pictures of his room. So I already knew it was gonna be really small. But honestly in real life, it's not too bad. But yeah, I'm standing at the door. Right here I have these drawers. There's a little mirror. That's honestly not a lot of space. There's more drawers here. Next to that is the bed. They provided this mattress thing, but I'm pretty sure it's like really thin. And then above the bed are these shelves. And then next to the bed is the desk. The chair is bubble wrapped, meaning it's new. And then next to that is the view. Not much, but pretty cool. This is not even a mattress. It's so thin. It's already past like 4 p.m. and all I did was unroll my mattress. Before I start unpacking, I think I'm gonna head to 7-Eleven to get something to eat. Let's go. The weather here is so nice, I love it.
forgot I packed a few back in here. <laughs> I brought my D room speaker with me. I'm gonna listen to music right now while I unpack. I think it's out of battery. It's now 7.25 p.m. but I still didn't finish unpacking. I was FaceTiming my sister so I kind of procrastinated but I actually have to leave now because I'm meeting up with my friend so we decided to meet up at 7.30 so I guess I'm just gonna finish unpacking when I'm back. Honestly, I feel so unorganized right now because ever since landing, I still haven't figured anything out. I have to figure out like my eSIM, my student card. I don't have any hangers with me, so my friend gave me three. I'm also wearing my jujitsu shirt. Today just felt like the longest day of my life. I'm running on such a little sleep too, but it's 12, 16 a.m. But earlier I mentioned that I was quickly just going out to see my friend, but when I went out, there were a group of people who were also here on exchange, and we ended up all just going to a night market. So yeah, I was not planning to go that far. That's why I wore my Crocs and not a cute outfit. I managed to take everything out of my suitcases, but most of the stuff are just on my desk like that. I have orientation tomorrow. It's for the non-local students who are here on exchange at HKU. It's at 9.45 a.m. So I have to wake up really early to get ready. But when I was out earlier, just exploring and walking around the city and being in Hong Kong, life just felt very surreal. I don't know. I'm back in my room and I did so much shopping today. I bought everything that I needed and I finally have bed sheets now because yesterday I didn't have bed sheets and I was just using this tiny blanket and a towel so I was freezing the whole night but I did so much walking around today my legs felt like they were gonna give up on me and I was just so tired so when I got back to my room I lied down for like 20 minutes but I'm going out again right now because my friends want to get dinner it's 8 10 p.m honestly I just wanted to spend tonight lying down in my bed and sleeping or like going on my phone because I'm so tired and I'm not like 
too much in the mood to socialize but i'm on exchange and i just realized when am i ever gonna have this experience again so the name oh <laughs> and face they're so swollen but today i have lunch plans with my friends and then after that i'm gonna try to go to one of the welcome week events that the school hosts i forgot to sign up for any of them so they were all full by the time i wanted to sign up basically the university offers like different touristy stuff that you can do with other students but i heard that apparently if you just show up you can still join so i'm just gonna do that today today's event is the peak it's like a little hike i'm so tired right now though because i got like three hours of sleep hopefully i feel fine throughout the day Yeah. 